Okay, here you can see that I have a three nodes. So this I will call it as node one and node two. So first I will connect my virtual machine one master. Then I will change the host name. How to change host name? Okay. Is there is any other method? Any simple method instead of going to uh, like host file and all? Hmm? So let me connect the server first. I'll show you that. Okay. So here you can see that I have a master node over here. See, suppose if you want to change your host name, so you can direct one minute. Okay. Suppose if you want to change your host name, so you can execute host name CTL, write it down. Host name CTL, then set host name, set hyphen host name. Simply you can set so only we need to execute these two commands automatically the host name will be changed to whatever you want. See host name, then I will provide master. See now what is my host name as of now? Eh? What is my host name? IP 172.31.47 right. See if you want to find host name you can just uh, print echo host name. Echo host name. See here you can see that my sorry. We have to provide dollar over here. Let me put capital. Okay what is the host name? IP? 172 31 47 115 and AP South 1 dot compute Indiana right and I want to change that uh, like uh, whatever the uh, content into master so for that what is the command okay host name CTL so we have to use host name CTL then set host name then then master okay master okay then enter okay but still I am getting the same host name. See, whatever the previous host name have, I have a same host name. So what should I do? Then? The eh? No, sudo minus i. We only need to put sudo minus i. Automatically it will change master. We only need to refresh that's it. Okay, sudo minus i. See, now you can see that my host name is a master. So I will execute once again what is my host name. Uh, then echo capital dollar first we have to put dollar then costner you can see that now my host name is <coughs> what's my host name master okay so then i'll go to my second system as well i will create a node one over here and this will be act as a node two and this is node one so what's the comment host name ctl uh, host name ctl set host name then okay node 1 end then sudo minus i so you can see that node 1 now so i'll go to my third node then sudo su sudo su so then i will uh, use host name CTL set host name node 2 yeah sudo minus i you can see that I have a node 1 node 2 node 3 right so how to create a swam cluster how to create a swam cluster docker swam in it so I'll go to my master node first we have to install docker yeah I forgot that so first we have to install docker then we have to uh, execute docker swam in it I'm install docker minus y okay. then system ctl start <coughs> docker <coughs> yes <coughs> So I successfully installed docker the same I will do over here. Em install docker minus y. Em install docker minus y.
so now you can see that successfully installed docker right what is the command to create a cluster docker docker swam init okay when you execute in this command and you will be get one docker swam uh, like a cluster join link see docker swam join minus minus token then uh, you will be get one random token over here so that you have to copy so let me copy this token first i'll just copy it then go to your uh, node one so before i will execute docker node ls what is this command to list all nodes how many nodes i have over here only one node one, only one node what is the node name master i'll go to my second node then i will paste over here see this node joined as a swam worker i'll go to my master then i will execute docker node ls then write it down docker node ls to list all your nodes so now i will execute so now you can see that so i have a master node and i have a node okay i have a master node i have a worker node okay so i'll go to my third node so now i will execute this command once again over here and you can see that this node joined as a swam as a worker i'll go to my master node again so then i will uh, docker space node space ls you can see that i have a two nodes and as well as i have a one master node quite simple right but if you do in kubernetes actually it's a very difficult to do create a, a cluster and master any doubt any doubt ah <laughs> uh, that's adan uh, just copy and paste first you have to install docker on see listen first you have to install docker on uh, each your uh, like uh, node whatever it is virtual machine then you have to create a docker swarm init on ma uh, master virtual machine copy the token link then paste on your nodes that's it we can we can create ah eh da kittiyalo venam ellathirum venam in each system we have to download docker ellathirum install cheyanu okay see now my system is connected and whatever the service i am creating automatically the service will be deployed in node 1 node 2 and master docker init kodutha adikku veru veru master maatrame engana da docker node ls master maatrame kittullu see uh, for example if i go to my worker node then i will execute docker node then ls and here you can see that error response from dmod this node is not a swam manager so that what that's what actually we discussed only the manager only can take decision that's what is the orchestration to so he is going to dominate them in the sense he going to take a decision and the workers they will be obey that you getting okay suppose see you same want a uh, same network or else you can do one thing see <coughs> when you creating one minute adathil <laughs> ip address na kanichu see listen listen one minute one minute i'll go to my notepad then i'll paste the link over see so this is my token link see in this token you can see that docker swam joy minus minus token i, I got on random token right suppose consider i have a master node i have and someone has created worker node in his computer wherever it is so what i can do here i can uh, copy paste the public ip address then full colon 2377 port number 2377 so docker swam that is responding or listening 2377 okay even if it, even if it is that is in a same network i can connect my docker swan i can create a cluster so when i am private ip because i created in a same local vpc that's what okay i can create in a different vpc different region different account or different uh, cloud as well so then after i can create a cluster it's possible ah ip address matter public we only need to change the ip address then we can do it if you already connected a vpn then you can use the private ip as well no problem master ip avada kodukona ആ ആ വി ഹാവ് ടു നോട്ട് മാസ്റ്ററിന്റെ ഐ പി ആ മാസ്റ്ററിന്റെ ഐ പി കൊടുക്കണം മാസ്റ്ററിന്റെ ഐ പി കൊടുക്കണം എനി ഡൗട്ട് ടു ക്രിയേറ്റ് എ മാസ്റ്റർ ആൻഡ് ടു ആഡ് നോട്ട്സ് ഓൺ മാസ്റ്റർ ടു നോട്ട് ഒരു നോട് ഉണ്ട് ബാക്കിയുള്ള നമുക്ക് ഇതേപോലെ ഇനി കൊടുത്തിട്ട് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും അപ്പോൾ അത് മാസ്റ്റർ ആവും മാസ്റ്റർ ആവില്ല അത് ഒരിക്കലും ജോയിൻ ചെയ്തിട്ടില്ലെങ്കിൽ മാസ്റ്റർ ആവുള്ളൂ ആ 
ജോയിൻ ചെയ്തിട്ടില്ലെങ്കിലും നമുക്ക് എന്ത് ഒരു നോഡിനെ പ്രൊമോട്ട് ചെയ്യാനേ പറ്റുള്ളൂ പ്രൊമോട്ടിയുള്ള കമാറ്റിൽ വരുന്നുണ്ട് വൺ ബൈ വൺ പഠിക്കുന്ന നമ്മൾ ഓക്കെ ഇപ്പൊ നമ്മൾ എന്ത് ചെയ്തു ഒരു ക്ലസ്റ്റർ ക്രിയേറ്റ